Good evening, everybody, and welcome. And I forgot to turn the light on. I'll be right back. It's probably helpful to be able to, you know, see me. Doing well, Adam. Welcome. It's good to see you, dude. So tonight is my 197th stream in a row, and it's going to be day 197 of Animal Crossing, uh, which will be at 197 out of 2,000. We're almost done. Like I've mentioned, Animal Crossing is going to go strictly to YouTube, and then we're going to have a lot of fun on this channel playing retro console and PC games from there. So uh, let's go ahead and get into day 197 while the store's still open. But it's good to see you again as well, Adam. Hope you're doing well and had a good Saturday. I guess it's Sunday morning for you now? Oh, that's right. It's Big Top's birthday today. I got to take care of that, too. Okay, so we're going straight to the store. So I don't have a shovel right now anyway. We will check mail really quick. Sunday morning, 4.35 a.m. Are you up late or are you up early? I go to bed 6 p.m. and woke up at 2 a.m. Yikes. You know what? As out of character as it is... Never mind, I'm not giving him a $100,000 server. You know, this may be a weird gift. It's Sunday, I can sleep the whole day. Those are wonderful. Let's give Big Top Yes, gift wrap. I don't know if he'll use it, but I hope he will. Okay, I take care of Big Top's birthday present first. You can make money with mumpkins. <laughs> I've already planted some, Adam. I'm going to be watering them after we're done with Big Top. Oh, I forgot to buy a shovel. Hello, boys. I'm back. But yeah, I've already got a pumpkin patch going. I'll show you in just a minute. I think you can sell them for triple the cost full grown. Probably. But you can also use them as a crafting material, which is what I kind of plan to have them for. <laughs> Quite frankly, I have something like three and a half million bells in the bank, so... Um... 
Yep. Lachlan, welcome. Yep, it's Big Top's birthday. I gave him a rush to Tommy in the hopes that he'll actually, you know, have a floor that's not dirt. How are you today, Lachlan? Good to see you. And I see we have a Nin lurking, so I'm going to say hello to him, too. Glad to hear it, dude. Hope you had a good uh, Saturday. Go dig up the fossil in my front yard. <clears throat> Damn it, she sprouted another blue. My pumpkins has sprouted. And this is actually kind of perfect. Let's put this guy right here. Yeah, I'm starting for the late start tonight, folks. I'd actually uh, originally planned on an early start tonight. And uh, I ended up getting the opportunity to uh, go out to dinner tonight. So I took that opportunity. So, uh, got on a little later than planned. But hey, real life always comes first. I already know his end style stone. Yeah, and a bunch more flowers we don't need. Apologize. I see we're dropping some frames tonight. I have been uh, pushing my internet tonight, kind of particularly hard. Week hard. This last week, not to mention my computer in general. probably really need to reboot the computer. I'll probably do that tonight. I've been converting old videos and old streams and uploading them to YouTube like mad. Trying to get as close to caught up as I can before uh, episode 200 and Animal Crossing goes to being all um, YouTube. 
<clears throat> so basically the plan tomorrow morning I'm gonna plan to start somewhere around nine we'll start out with Animal Crossing like usual and then we're gonna transition to Starcraft Monday will be day 199 which will be Animal Crossing and then Tuesday Uh, it's a bit of an older CPU at this point. It's a few years old. Uh, I believe it's a... God, I don't actually remember off the top of my head. It's nothing expensive. It's an i5, I want to say. i5 and a GTX 1050, I think is what I'm running, if I remember right. My computer's far from a powerhouse, but it does everything I need it to do. Assess my fossils. I don't play anything high end, Adam. And I'm not a big graphics guy, so I don't, even if I do get a newer game. I don't feel the need to play at 4K maximum settings. It serves my needs. But it hasn't been restarted probably in a week and a half. Yeah, it is multi-core. Yeah, I don't have anywhere near that many. Give me one second. Not what I meant to go to. Broom Hatter! Well, thanks for stopping in, Broom Hatter. I appreciate it. It's always good to see you, dude. Hopefully you can hang out a little bit more tomorrow for the longer stream. Let's see here. Okay, I was wrong. It's not an i5. It's a uh, Ryzen 5 1400 quad-core 3.2 gigahertz is what I'm running with 32 gigs of RAM. And then it's a GTX 1050. I upgraded the RAM, Adam. It originally had only uh, eight. It had originally had only sixteen.
Yeah. Like I said, it does everything I needed to do. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm just not in a position where I can spend that kind of money on a computer, Adam. <clears throat> I got this one about two years ago, and I'll be probably using it for another two to three. said does absolutely everything I needed to do so I'm good Okay, let's hit the waha. But yeah, the RAM going to 32 was an upgrade. I put some uh, Trident G skill in. By the way, I might need some advice from you in the not-so-distant future, Adam. They are... Have you ever heard of Hero Quest? Yeah, I backed it too. And I have never, uh... I don't know if I'm going to do it, but I have never painted a miniature in my life. Yeah, that sucks, dude. This thing's being a pain. What is... That's something new. I got a Venus's flower basket. Why was she picking flowers here? <clears throat> Probably if I decide to paint it. I don't know if I'm going to. I don't know for sure that I'd have the patience and or the time to actually do it. Get back here. 
God, is this another one? Well, it's like I love in this new version that the mini, the uh, furniture and doors are miniatures and not just like little cardboard cutouts in. Oh no, you don't get back here. Little stands. Whoa! What the? I got a spiny lobster. It's got a lot of backbone. Oh, there's two new sea creatures tonight, so that's good. Taco. I agree. Oh, don't get me wrong. I'm glad it's that way, but... At the same time, you know, those since those used to have color, I might want them to have color again. Too early. I missed so much letters this morning. What was that about colors? How the furniture in the new one are going to be all, you know... In fact, all the miniatures in the new one, it looks like, are going to be just gray plastic. Whereas, you know, in the original, since the furniture was the, like, cardboard bits, they had some color... And the figures, at least depending on the creature, were creatures were different colors. Like the goblins and the orcs and the fenriers were green. You know, the undead creatures were like that bone white. The gargoyle and the chaos knights were gray. If everything's going to be the exact same color, then that's going to make me a little more tempted to paint them. What tier did you back at, Adam, if you don't mind my asking? I decided I had to back at the tier that comes with the two expansions. True. Maybe they will. Hopefully they will. I mean, it's kind of like, you know, the Mystic tier is a no-brainer, really, because, you know, just buying one of those expansions by themselves would cost more than the whole Mystic tier if you wanted to buy them from the original game. Ooh, pardon me, big yawn. Well, when I went at one point, I decided I wanted to get all the Hero Quest stuff. And it wasn't even as expensive when I was first looking into it, and I still decided it was too expensive.
Now the expansions, if you find them complete, are going for like 250 bucks. At least for the two that came out in the States, the ones that never left Europe are even more. I really hope it's successful enough that uh, they not only release these first two expansions, but all the other ones, including the ones that never got released in the States, as well as uh, create some new ones. I'd jump on them. Oh, my inventory. I got a whole row. I saw the advertising on TV when I was a kid. I had the game when I was a kid. I had the game and I had the uh, Keller's Keep expansion. So yeah, we'll have to see. Hopefully they do colored miniatures. But yeah, they look... The miniatures themselves look so much nicer. Master Betty, welcome! Welcome to day 197! My brother has a hero quest with one expansion. I have the ga base game and... I have one of the expansions myself right now. Actually, I think I have the booklets for both expansions, but I only have the figures and stuff for one of them. Welcome back. So how are you today, Master Betty? Did you have a good start to your weekend? Glad to hear it. My day started off a little rough with work, but... Oh, great. Another chaser. It is chilly here. It's actually in the 40s right now here. Which I wouldn't mind as much if I didn't... If I had working central heat... Nom nom nom, Adam. Is this one a chase or two? It is, but to a lesser degree. We caught that one. Just a Nautilus. Now let's get this guy. Come here. D 
Damn it, they should tire out after a while. What are you looking for, Adam? Oh no, I had him cornered and let him get away. Um, mystery SFX. That'll give you the details and then mystery lists to pull up the actual list of mystery tracks that haven't been solved. Damn it, we got him in the corner. I gotta not let him get away. There we go. Another one of these things. Three more catches before I'm out of inventory. New past tense? Now well, think about it. Only three of these have been solved so far. Just kind of remember, the theme is that all of them are shop themes. It's all music that plays in different shops. Was there frame drops? Twitch was loading for 10 seconds ago. There might have been. I've been having some frame drops off and on all night. I've dropped 2,975 over the 45 minutes we've been streaming. <clears throat> I would like to start with a Venus flower basket. The Venus's flower basket looks like an otherworldly creature one would find on an alien planet. But it is instead a remarkable sea sponge found in the deepest parts of the ocean. Its body is composed of silica and looks like a sculpture, or perhaps a vase made of glassy mesh. I dare say the Venus's flower basket is one of nature's most impressive works of art. Thank <laughs> you. 
It is the spiny lobster's lengthy antennae that help set it apart from other lobsters. Those two antennae can grow twice as long as the lobster's own body. And what a clever crustacean it is! Having found a way to use those antennae as a means of defense. When the spiny lobster senses danger, it rubs its antenna across its exoskeleton. The horrid screeching sound frightens predators away. If someone scratched nails across a chalkboard in your direction, I dare say you'd run too. Mm. I got an itch like right in the middle of my back. Mm. Something like this, I wish I hadn't lost my back scratcher. Back to the water. Back into the water. I come in search of scallops. But yeah, needless to say, with my heat out, it gets a little chilly in here at 40 degrees out, so. Fortunately, I have my nice warm pajama pants on and my slippers, so I'm nice and comfy still. This could be it. No. She's dark. Hope everybody here did have a wonderful weekend so far, and we're looking forward to tomorrow's stream as well. Like I said, tomorrow we're going to start with Animal Crossing, probably about 9 o'clock. We'll do Animal Crossing until about 10. And then after a brief break, we will be going back to StarCraft. I also have something else nice on its way. I ordered a monitor. So I think I've mentioned to everybody before, right now I use my 55-inch uh, 4K TV as my computer monitor. <clears throat> but the problem is, is because of the way everything is set up, the only way for me to play right now and be able to monitor chat is for me to have everything on the screen. So when I'm using the capture card, I'm not using the pass-through on the capture card to play. I'll catch it as soon as I get out of uh, stream, Adam. And also, if you haven't already, I have my... Uh, you can also... Are more than welcome to join my Discord. But anyway, because of the way I do my capture card, I get some input lag. Which is why sometimes I miss on some of the harder easy, harder fish and stuff like that. So with the monitor, I should be able to use the capture card's actual pass-through. Gotcha. I didn't... I couldn't remember, Adam. But, uh, yeah, with the extra monitor, I'll be able to use the actual pass-through. Which means I'll finally be able to do some of the stuff I've been wanting to do for ages, like stream my Famicom, do a Famicom Disk System stream. Um, the monitor, I think the TV can. I don't know about the monitor. 
The monitor, the only thing I was looking for was a cheap monitor that could do portrait orientation. The only thing the monitor is going to be for is for chat, basically. Lobster. I'll move chat and stuff like that over to the monitor. Maybe depending on the game, if I need it, something like maps and stuff can be over there too. Like I know one of the games that I've that Sky Coaster Man has been requesting for ages that I play is uh, Play Through Willow. And nobody can memorize their way through fucking Willow. So we'll need maps for that. <laughs> yeah, I've heard, and apparently some uh, initial benchmarks have potentially leaked. And if they are what they look like, it's going to be they're going to be pretty nice processors. God, why am I getting all the chasey sea creatures tonight? Especially considering whatever they are, I don't even particularly want them. I just want a scallop. So I can meet with Pascal and hopefully get my next piece of mermaid set. Oh no, you don't. Like, I honestly don't know why I'm bothering to chase this thing. I don't need it, most likely. I don't need the money, for sure. And we know for a fact it's not the scallop I'm looking for. The scallops don't run like this. Okay, F you. HBU, welcome! How are you this evening? Hopefully you've had a good weekend. HV, okay, got it. Welcome to the stream. Gallop. Well, we are having a good evening and have had a good Saturday. I've probably done every individual portion of installing a PC 
of installing something to a PC, but I've never actually built one from scratch, no. I mean, I've installed a processor once. I've installed RAM more times than I can count. I've changed out a power supply. I've put in drive bays. That's kind of my thing too, Lachlan. Yeah, I know how, though I still kind of count myself lucky I didn't screw up the one CPU upgrade I ever did. In fact, I kind of did. I didn't... I thought it was tightened down all the way, and it wasn't. Thought I had killed my computer. I opened it back up and realized what I had done. You know, there's certain stuff I'm more than comfortable with. And the itch. Installing a PCI card, that's easy. Not off the top of my head, Adam. I'll see if I can check after the stream. If I fill my inventory a second flipping time without getting a scallop, we're going to call it a give up for tonight. So how are you doing, HV? Hope hope you're doing well. Good to have you here. I want to say 3300 if I remember right. Thousand, that might be it. Like I said, I can check and make sure when I get stream over. I don't want to keep digging into my uh, control panel and stuff while I'm trying to stream, you know?
Just a reminder for anybody who's been uh, checking out the Mystery SFX, the Mystery NES Sound Challenge. If you do solve Mystery UC, the Mystery Ultra Challenge, you not only get your name displayed every time that song gets played from then on, but as part of the Ultra Challenge, you also get a gift sub. Five more catches, and then we give up on getting a scallop tonight. Two full inventories is enough trying. <laughs> I wonder if PS2 is considered old enough to be considered retro nowadays. Sure. I'll say one thing. I know I am do not want to mess with anything with water cooling. Like ever. I watch uh, Linus Tech Tips a lot, and I've seen them build a lot of water-cooled systems, and I'm just kind of like, that looks like just way too much trouble. That's it. I officially am giving up for the night. We've done two nearly full flipping inventories of sea creatures and not found a single scallop. Well, for better luck tomorrow. Yeah. And that's the thing. I don't want to have to keep... No, I haven't. I don't really plan to, Adam. I mean, I'm sure I'll end up with one eventually. But as of right now, there's nothing announced for PS5 that I actually care about.
I mean, I'm sure I'll end up getting one because chances are, like, the next Persona game is probably still going to be PlayStation exclusive and some other games will eventually come out I want, but I'll at least wait for the first price drop, you know? <clears throat> I don't feel the need to... It is like I never have felt the need to get an Xbox One. There's just never been anything on that system that appealed to me as something that I want. The only games I would want to play on Xbox are also available on PC. <laughs> Loved my 360, but the 360 had a much larger variety to its... Uh, The 360 had a much larger variety to its library and had more games that were kind of my style of game. Anyway, I want to thank everybody for hanging out tonight. I hope you all had fun. Adam, thank you so much for being here and chatting so much. Uh, Lachlan, thanks for being here. Master Betty, thank you for hanging out. Nin was here for a while, and we have quite a few other people that have been lurking off and on. Thanks to all of you for being here. Let me see if there is anybody on. I want to throw a raid to tonight. Is Tony Uncle Al playing? No. We're going to raid my friend Dot. Dot's playing Castlevania 3. Thanks again, everybody, for hanging out. I hope you had fun. When we get to Dot's chat, please announce the arrival of the Jogurt army. If you have uh, Jogurt emotes, please spam them in his chat. Thanks again for everything. I'll see you guys tomorrow morning for Animal Crossing and StarCraft. Have a good night. Rest well and take care. I'll see you all again soon. Thanks again for everything. Night, everybody.